So let's get into this good conversation that we shall have. Okay. Talking about time management and all the good juicy things, okay? Yeah. So time management is super critical for moms that juggle various responsibilities. Yes. Um, what are some of the most prominent challenges that you face in managing your time? Whew. I think getting caught in the small things a lot of the time is what uh, really disrupts my time management because, you know, I have this, this, this on my schedule for today. I, I know the outline. I know what I have to do. But then monkey wrench. Phew, here comes this. They called me to pick up the baby mm. or, um, you know, my husband has something on his agenda that I didn't know about. So now it's like you, you know, you're having to rearrange. Right what your time management look like. Exactly. Um, so um, those are the biggest monkey wrenches. But yeah. I think that at that point, you just have to understand every day is different. Correct. If you plan and over plan, mommyhood is going to give you a new plan. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and literally, you just kind of have to go with it. Right. I think. Um, and that's the that's the best thing that I learned be becoming a mom is that. I'm not in control mm. and I did do some um, therapy and stuff and I uh, the consensus was my therapist was like you're a control person mm. not controlling but a control person so I like to have order in things I know how I want them I know and it's not like a I'm not like a um, stickler or nothing like that like not um, but if you can, if you can have a, a word in it, you want to make sure that it's what it needs to be. Oh, oh, I'm very sure. Mm -hmm. I am very sure. I certain am very about certain want. about what I want. Um, you c you know, I've researched it. I've overthought it. I've thought about it 60 times. And now when I come, I know what I want. Now, what kind of line of work are you in? Cause it's gotta be aligned with that. <laughs> Girl, I'm crazy. So I work in I work in sales. Mm -hmm. So I sell advertising, and that is very different. That mm. that world is like, yeah. So, um, but with time management and a strategic plan, you can, you know, that's what you need to make it work. Because if not, you'll be all over the right, place. Right, because that's a high stress type job. High stress type job, and it, that's even more reason why everything in my life has to be, um, like, kind of. Um, in managed order. well mm -hmm. and I say that because you know we have we we all have friends and family and my family is very close mm -hmm. and I can easily get pulled in a different direction from my own plan yeah um, from friends and family the you know just the obligations of of life um, I am a new mom you know he's he's two so a lot of my friends are like you know well, when are we gonna do this again when are we gonna do that and literally it's like a lot of times I'm not able to right and I have to um, even manage some expectations, some girlfriend, some just me time in there yeah. with balancing the expectations of friends and family. Yeah. So with that being said, like, tell me about your village and how how important of a role they play in all of that. Oh, my goodness. So I have an amazing village. So I'm having twins. My mom is a twin. So I have basically like two moms. <laughs> <laughs> um, my dad is very active. Um, uh, he's a, my son calls him GP. So he's very active in my son's life. Mm -hmm. Um, I have three grandmas. Yes. Two of them are in Atlanta. My other grandmother is in Virginia. So literally we have a lot of support and I do, um, you know, at first I used to feel guilty to lean on that support. Not anymore. Mm -hmm. And it helps with my time management because if like, I'm lucky, blessed, my parents will get my baby three times a week, girl. I don't know how they're going to do with three. I don't know when th how they're going to do when three They're excited. Come. I know they, they are. are. They are over the moon. But I will say they do. They allow um, me and my husband to have time. So it makes the time management easier when you have the help. Um, but also, I don't want to discourage people who don't have that, that mm. family unit because you still... Um, your routine is what gives you the time that you need to decompress. It gives you the time that you need to like, um, you know, get things done. And I will say I do a lot of, I noticed when, with my time management, when I had, um, you know, these big goals, it was like a monkey on my back. Mm. But when I started making, like making a list of things and then being able to cross those things off the list, my list may take a week 
Yeah. It may take two weeks, but just it's a smaller chunk, a smaller chunk of, you know, um, to do's. Mm -hmm. It made it easier. And um, I'm nesting y'all. So the house is like, I got to do this. I got to do that. I got to do this. And I had to take a step back. Right. Because I can't do it all. You can't right. Do all of that. And, you know, you ask husband mm -hmm. to move and it won't happen today to move the um, <laughs> can you move this dresser? <laughs> and then, <laughs> you know, I sent hints. I'll scoot it out a little bit, pull it, you know, like mm -hmm. do something. It's not happening today. It's not happening. it's not happening next week, but it will happen. And I had to like find comfort in the fact that, um, where I'm a now, now, now person, um, I can't, I can't do it now. Right. So I got to give him a little bit of time and I, I have started like making us both lists. Yeah.